Hello? city has for traffic, but the future standards that they've adopted for traffic. And in that, we're providing $8 million of funding. Many of those intersections, we have very little impact on, 1 to 5 percent. But nonetheless, looking forward, the smart thing to do is to do the improvements today. So that's what we're doing. And we're committed to doing that, which will be in a specific plan that will become law. So it's not like we'll ever have the discretion not to do it. From a legal standpoint, we're obligated to do it. And I'll spend a little bit more time talking about that. Um, we're encouraging bike trails. We're connected to the bike trails so that you can take a bike. You can go on the bike paths that are proposed down to the beach. We're actually going to have a bike program that I'm excited about where residents can just sign out a bike and take a bike off the property and take it down the trail and down to the beach. We want to get people out of their cars. We're going to be supporting trams that will connect to Legoland, tram that supports to the surf rider, a tram that can go across the street. The people want to shop across the street. So you park once, you enjoy the open space, you enjoy the retail here, or you enjoy the beach. Uh, we talked about the controls for the, the roadways, and the separate driveways are important. From a design standpoint, we want to separate the traffic going into our project and coming out so there's no delays on either one of those movements. Um, all of the studies that we have done are on our website, which I'll bring up our website in the water. Um, the city of Carlsbad had the foresight many years ago to put a reclaimed water line that runs adjacent to the property. So actually, all the outdoor space on the developed portion will use reclaimed water. Jimmy will continue to use fresh water, obviously, for farming. But because of best practices today, the amount <coughs> of water use on the property will be less than what it's been historically. And there's no cost to taxpayers. And there's no cost to the city. We're funding all of this, including the development of the open space, the improvements of the trails and the outdoor classroom. <coughs> And we're funding it so that there will be an endowment into perpetuity. And we cannot open our project until all of that is done. And that's the way the law is today. The plan is uh, supported by uh, the foundation, 